No, I can't just walk away. It's got to be here somewhere. When do I? Lan, did you find it? Who is that? The do-gooders here to save our mongrel souls, no doubt. Wait, they might know what's going on up there. <laughs> Tieflings are the descendants of people who sullied themselves by mating with demons. Our ancestors would never sink that low. We are the underground crusaders, the children of the crusade's finest. Sadly, underground crusaders is a bit of a mouthful, so people usually just call us mongrels. <laughs> You just love repeating that, don't you, Lan? Mongrels. That's what the Uplanders call us. But we call ourselves Neethers. No matter what you call us, it's not gonna stop our horns, hooves, or tails from growing. In Canabras, they're called mongrels. People say that they come up to the surface at night and eat anyone foolish enough to wander alone after midnight. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I thought you guys were just a tale to tell kids at night. <laughs> That's human gratitude for you. Our forefathers suffered the consequences of demonic corruption, all to protect Mendev and Golarion. And for what? So we could become monsters used to frighten children. <sighs> Every mongrel has their own take on it. Our chief, for example, thinks of us as something like a reserve military force. He thinks we're standing by until the moment we're needed, and when we emerge on the surface and save the day, all the people will see how good we are and they'll love us for it. Yeah, he leaves that last part out when he talks about it, of course, but it's easy enough to read between the lines. This is the hall where we remember the glory of our forebears. Sorry about the mess. Uh, it doesn't usually look like this, trust me. Sometimes we even wipe the dust off the exhibits. This is where the relics of the First Crusaders are displayed. Our lives are short. Our glories are quickly forgotten. But this place helps us to remember that we are just as worthy as anyone else. And that our lives are not lived in vain. Oh, the first Crusaders? You've been down here that long? That's crazy. That's none of your bit. We're looking for a holy sword. It was here, in the center, sticking out of a rock. The sooner we find it, the better. Some kids from our tribe took off for the shield maze. They figured it had collapsed, and now it's their time to go up to the surface, like all the legends foretold. Except they don't have a clue what's waiting for them up there. They're not fighters. And Sul, the chief of our tribe, is dead set against it. He says that now isn't the time for the underground crusaders to take up arms. If we get the holy sword, we might be able to change the Chief's mind. It's a fool's errand. None of us will be able to hold the sword, let alone use it to save anyone. It's not an ordinary weapon. It's made from righteous heavenly flame, and will burn anyone who touches it. Do you think you're special, Lan?
I'll pick it up with my teeth and tie it to my hand if I have to. It doesn't matter. An angel's sword and a troop of stalwart mongrels will be able to work a minor miracle. <laughs> uh, speaking of which, you're still here, Wendu, which means that deep down, you know it's possible. Yes. There are other ways up, but they are far from here, and after the earthquakes, there... Maze. There's a legend among our people that when the walls of the maze fall, that will be a signal for us, the underground crusaders, that the time has come to go up to the surface and fight the demons in the final confrontation. Until then, the people say the maze is shielding us from taking rash actions. I'm the only one in our whole tribe to have been in the maze. And even I don't know if it's true. But the further I went in the maze, the fresher the air became. That means that it really must lead to the surface. When the ceiling and walls started shaking, the young ones in our tribe lost their heads. They figured the maze was going to collapse, so it was time to go up to the surface. They grabbed whatever weapons were on hand and ran off toward the maze. They think the- Don't try to blame this on me. Yes, I told them that our people are capable of making our way through the maze. In the future. But I always told them to wait until I had made a map of all the maze's dangers. I warned them a hundred times. But it was no use. My words just went in one ear and out the other. It came here with its owner. A long time ago. Fifty thousand gongs, to be precise. Seventy years ago, in Uplander time. Fifty thousand gongs ago, our forebears found a dead angel here, along with the bodies of his comrades. The tribe gave them a dignified burial, and they were laid to rest with their weapons. But the flaming angelic sword was stuck in a rock, and no one was able to pull it out. It burned to the touch. Like real fire. Maybe the angel will dig himself out and find the sword for us. That might be our best shot in this chaos. Lan! Watch your tongue. Thanks. An extra pair of eyes can only help. The sword will be easy enough to spot. It looks, uh, sorty. Help us, and in return, we'll get you out of here. <laughs> now we're talking. Let's get to work. It's a good thing we all bumped into each other, isn't it? What? You want to find the sword quickly so the underground monsters bring you back to the surface? So be it. Found anything? I just thought it might be nice to know why the roof was shaking. What happened on the surface has caused problems for us, and we need to fix them. If things are as bad as you say, then we all have to hurry. You didn't come from the direction of the shield mace. Damn it. I couldn't care less about what's ha I realize that you guys have your own troubles, but we need to be in Canabras. People are dying up there. Please, show us the way out. Now, what is that? We make a great team together. 
I hope you appreciate this. What's on your mind? I wonder. So thoughts. So little time. What do we have here? Now what is that? Wherever my legs carry me. What do we have here? No secrets can escape my prying gaze.
Hey, are you all right? You were kind of glowing just now. That, that was it. The light of heaven, but how? What did you do with it? Where did it go? L'Oreal? That really was L'Oreal? The angel from the legends. The ancestors even got his name right on the gravestone. The chief will be thrilled. You. Thousands of gongs, and no one's been able to touch it. And now you, an ordinary creature of flesh and blood no different to us, get the sword and start talking about visions. Now, now, Wendoag, don't be a sore loser. She is clearly different from us. The sword appeared before her, along with the angel's name and all that other stuff. Because she doesn't carry our mongrel taint. Heaven doesn't give a damn how special we are. We're born with evil inside us. Heaven doesn't need to know any more than that. I know you're willing to tear anyone apart to uphold our people's honor, but... You and Sul, you just refuse to face the truth. We are the way we are because our ancestors' bodies were corrupted by the Abyss. It does the same thing to plants and animals. There's nothing heroic or special about it. It doesn't make us better, and it doesn't make us worthier. It's only us here, your group, you, me, Wendu, and the Light of Heaven that sort of got, uh, sucked into you. Any chance you can whip it out again, we do kind of need it. Sorry, I crack jokes when I get nervous, and when I'm upset, and when I'm happy. A anyway, what I said, it came out wrong. We need to bring you to Chief Sul. You can show everyone the light of heaven. We'll rally the tribe. And what if she can't make it happen a second time? What then? The tribe will just say we're crazy and turn its back on us. Oh, that is just... Wow, I mean, that's amazing! Heaven has truly blessed you. This power is the most majestic thing I've ever seen in all my life. Is this what the sun is like, Lan? Yes, it's similar. But this light is more... golden? Chief Sol needs to see this. Now that we have the power of angels on our side, he can't say no. He'll have to assemble a troop to storm the maze. You Uplanders care about your kids, right? Help us save ours. Without them, we won't survive. And then, the perils of the maze won't be so bad if we go together. We'll make our way through it and find the way to Canabras. Let's go. We'll take the short route. Well, the only route, really. Can't hide from me. No, what is that? No, backwards, backwards. Thanks, Lan. You're so awesome, Lan.
all right looks like i'll stop here peace out